Hello! Today I'm going to show you how to control the values that are entered into cells in a spreadsheet in order to ensure consistent and accurate data entry. This is called data validation. To access this, click on the data tab at the top of your spreadsheet and then click on validation. This is where you can adjust your specified cell range and this is where you can specify the criteria that need to be met in the cell. If the criteria is not met, it will either show a warning or reject the input. You also have the option here to display the criteria in the window to help out your users. So let's take a look at how this works. Here is a company directory that I'm going to share with my employees so they can fill it out so I can use it for our website. Now for me, it would be a huge pain if I had to go around and reformat each of these cells because people put their information in cells in different formats. For example, someone might list their office as 1 instead of 101, or maybe someone enters their start date in a different format. All of these are going to create a huge, time-consuming task for me as I prepare the data for use on the website. If I don't control how it can be entered beforehand, it's going to get pretty annoying. So instead, I'm going to select the office number column as my cell range, and then I'm going to specify that the criteria is a number, which I will set between 100 and 110, which are all of our office numbers. Then I'll set it to reject the input and save it. So now let's try to enter in some data outside of that range. I'll enter in 200, and the data just disappears. I can also try entering in the number 1, and it also just disappears. Like I said, this makes collecting data and information a lot easier when you can limit what people are able to put into the fields. This is especially great if you're going to share a document with a bunch of your users, and you don't want to have to worry about changing up the format based on everyone's unique way of inputting information. Thanks very much for watching. If you have any questions, just let us know in the comments under the video. Have a great day.